Hey Cyprus. So this past weekend in his message, Douglas talked about James chapter one, the verse that says, be quick to listen, slow to speak and slow to become angry. And in our home, we actually have that verse on a letter board in our living room, front and center. Um, because especially as we are raising kids and teaching them to be effective communicators, it is a great reminder of the way that we can help bring peace into our home. But inevitably, each one of us are not always successful at those things. And so there's another verse that when we are less successful, um, we remind ourselves it's um, in Colossians 4 verse 6, where Paul says, Be gracious in your speech. The goal is to bring out the best in others in conversation, not to put them down, not to cut them out. There have been many times where we do have to stop ourselves and say, are the words that I'm speaking bringing out the best in someone else? And there's another quote from um, a pastor, Jean-Marc Comer, where in a recent message he said, people will live up or down to the words you speak over them, which as a parent, as a coworker, as a friend, that's a really powerful thing to know that the things that I am speaking to people have that kind of power to lift them up or to pull them down. And so I really charge each one of us as we go about our conversations, whether in words or with typing, that we are really conscious of the way that we're allowing God to flow through us and that whether or not our words and our actions are pulling people up or pulling them down. Thanks, Cypress.